Why do you want to be U.S. ambassador to the EU? I mean, you're clearly not a great fan of Brussels or his bureaucrats like Jean-Claude Juncker. Well, I uh, had in a previous career a diplomatic post where I helped to bring down the Soviet Union. So maybe there's another union that needs a little taming. So you, uh, if, got... if I may say so, Andrew, it's only the British who believe that an ambassador from one country to another has to take on the point of view of the country to which he's sent, rather than the point of view of the country which is sending him. But it's yeah, a bit unusual to send an ambassador to bring down the country the to EU, which you yeah. have been sent to. Well, I, I, think we want the Ameri <laughs> I think we want the American ambassador to the EU to represent America, not the EU. What do you think of Mr. Juncker? Well, Mr. Juncker was a very adequate mayor, I think, of some city in Luxembourg, and maybe he should go back and do that again. Oh, well, this is clearly going to be a very diplomatic appointment <laughs> when you get there. Will you, will you keep in touch with us? I can't Just uh, have a chat with Nigel Farage. He's in the this, same diplomatic corps as you. This is going to be, but it's going to be more fun than Washington. I think so. Yeah, well, we look forward to it. Thank you for being with us. Next time we'll have to call you Mr. Ambassador.